As you might have gathered, we did a lot of thinking about the discussion section in the last unit when we talked about interpreting the results. This is just the point we need to pull all that together for the reader. The discussion section basically includes four parts. In fact, for simple studies like ours, they may be four paragraphs or less. The first part, and the opening of the discussion, is a summary of the results and words. For example, saying participants scored higher in perseverance than consistency and interest. We would then go on to explain how that fits with other work. We might explain if it makes sense given other findings, if it contradicts other work, or if we can consider both our findings and other work to gain new insight. The third component is an evaluation of our study, strengths and weaknesses of the methodology. Finally, we suggest next steps for the work. What new question did we create? What gap in understanding did we discover?